Hey guys, what's up? Welcome to No Man's Sky. Now, this is launched today on the PS4. I've been hearing mixed things about... Oh, wait, what? What's going on? Twelve point nine degrees C. That's quite cold, but it looks like a desert planet. Hmm. Five point seven rads. Eleven tox. Sure, whatever. Welcome to Akaidarario. If I'm saying that right, I feel like I'm locked in some kind of tutorial. But this was launched today. It comes out on PC next week, roughly. I've been hearing that there's some frame rate issues with the PS4 version. But uh, I, I was so keen to jump in, I didn't want to wait any longer. Now, I know very little about this game. I, didn't, I haven't really followed development very much at all. From what I've heard, and from what I can tell, it's a very open-world, sandboxy game that's craft-heavy. It looks like I'm at the wreckage of my spaceship. It's... It's... Oh, it's smoking. Okay. Uh, but we can solve this. We can solve this. Interact with it? Yeah, sure. Find... Oh, what was that? Wait, wait, wait. What did I do? This technology is critically damaged. It looks like my ship's wrecked. So we've got launch thruster there and pulse engine. Both look pretty wrecked. Plutonium is required to be recharge the thruster. And Thamium-9 is required to charge the pulse engine. All right. So it looks like that's what we're doing. Let's get out of the... Uh, get out of the spaceship. And see if we can go and find some of these vital minerals on the planet. Debris, interact, distress beacon. What is this? Is this my distress beacon? Or do I have to shoot one off? Reality seems to fold in on itself. One moment I can see debris. In another, a vast red orb. Almost too large and too bright to behold. It knows me, inside out. More than I ever could myself. Could this be the face of creation itself? Or, in my hazy, freshly awakened state, am I being manipulated? What? A name burns itself into my mind, Atlas. And a request made without words that I should follow the path this being, Atlas, has set for me. Wow, there's actually a story. Accept Atlas's guidance, aka do the tutorial, or spurn direction and explore freely. Oh, no. I'm tempted to spurn direction, but come on. This game is so deep that I'm going to need some help from this little red shit. Feel so few to the warm glow of approval. I was lost, but I am now found. The Atlas acknowledges my allegiance, and I didn't get time to read the rest of that. So I've got to repair the thrusters, repair the pulse engine, and refuel the thrusters. Let's keep looking around, see what we can do. Right, well, I see what I'm doing. So far, I'm just looking around this the, the wreck here, where I crash-landed, maybe? So what else is around here? I still have no idea what I'm supposed to do. That's the ship, which I've interacted with. Uh, what do I see? Oh! Oh, whoa, whoa! Right, okay, so this is a mining laser. And I shoot stuff to suck up the iron. So I'm just literally sucking the iron out of this thing. Uh, but it gets too hot and has to cool down. Okay, cool. So this is how you, this is how you dig in the game? You just suck iron out of stuff? All right, cool. This is the mining beam. And I'm probably going to need a bunch of this iron. So I'm just going to keep sucking this up. This is actually a lot of fun, though. Whoa, 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 whoa. What are you talking about? Oh, no! What the hell? Wait, wait, whoa, 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 whoa. Can I shoot them? I can shoot them with the mining laser. But it doesn't do much damage. I'm taking health. I'm taking health damage. What the hell's going on? Okay. So we, we got titanium. What about this thing? Oh. Now, again, I'm finding it quite difficult to aim. Because this is PS4, and I'm using a controller. But I've iced that guy now. If I remember right, there was one more. Oh my god, no, there's loads more. What are we doing? No! Stop! Leave me alone! I just want to explore space like a cool dude. Didn't sign up for this. Um, all right, loads of titanium. I'm gonna get back in my ship before I die. Oh my god, where is my ship? Destroy drones before they alert others, or avoid detection to escape. Restore point safe. Okay, I got my health back. Okay, so I can actually just hide in there. Now, 
I don't think I have a laser gun. I just have a mining laser. Come on. No. Okay. Woo. Oh, man, that was close. I can't believe I almost got wasted in the tutorial. Journey milestone accomplished. I have no idea what's going on. I'm blundering through this game like crazy, but sure. Whatever. I destroyed one sentinel, and that's leveled me up. That's apparently supposed to happen. I destroyed five sentinels, and now I'm a scrapper. Great. Cool. All right, we're back in the game. So, repair starship launch thrusters. Oh, right. So, I can, I can repair this analysis visor now. So I've got the iron. Optical enhancement and creature discovery system. Uh-oh, hang on a sec. Oh, man. What are you doing? No. Get out of it. Aha! Plutonium! Just what I need to charge my laser. Whoa! Oh, come on! Alright, so let's just wreck some more flowers and get some more stuff, maybe? My, my mining laser's got loads of charge now, so it looks like ammo for this thing's not going to be a big issue. But, oh my god, wait, hang on a sec. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Oh my god, it's big. Is it hostile? Hello? Oh, it's cute. Feed. Interact. 20 carbon required. Okay, I can do that. I can gather carbon to feed this thing. Oh, some isotope here. What happens when you feed it? Does it poo? Do you, do, you, do you need the poo? Maybe it poos like some valuable mineral I need to, uh, to fix my ship. That will make sense. It looks like it's going to be that kind of game. Come here, lad. It's like a bear meets a hedgehog. Okay, I, I think I fed it and it gave me craft karite sheet in inventory. Just press square on empty slot. Ah, here we go! Right! And I just need iron! Oh, I had it all, all along. So I've got one there, two, and that's all I can get. I need to gather more iron to do more. So if I just transfer this back, I need to dig up enough iron to get one more. Yeah! Now what? Return to your starship. Press that and then hold X to repair. Okay, so the starship was... was it this way? Yeah, that's right, it was through this this little kind of gap, wasn't it? Oh my god, what? Did something just bite me? Oh my god! What? What the hell was that? Ah! Oh my god, it's like a little tick. It's shrinking me! Is it shrinking me? Oh my god, oh my god, it's gonna kill me. It's gonna kill me. It's gonna jetpack the hell out of here. Oh! <laughs> oh my god! Oh my god! I <laughs> gravity, gravity failed me. That little tick shit. The big problem we had there is not realizing we could just use iron to craft the things we needed to repair this ship. Return to death location to recover inventory. Oh, okay. Right, so all is not lost. Right, so now I know how this works. Back at the starship. Do I go inside it? Maybe I do. Press my inventory, starship. And I've got what I need to repair the technology. Now I need Karite Sheets Heridium and Zinc, which I already have, to repair my pulse engine. I need to repair the pulse engine and then refuel the launch ship. So where am I going to find that other rare material? Man, this world, though, is so impressive. I really can't wait to play this on PC. Part of me kind of wishes I'd waited, but I'm glad, because when I get to play it on PC now, I'll have a bit of a head start, since I know how the game works. I'm just going to use my jetpack, but be careful not to kind of come down too hard. All right, so what's here it is! Yes, Iridium. This is exactly what I'm looking for. Whoa, now I am blasting big-ass holes through this. What happens if I blow away all of the support struts, though? Does it all come tumbling down? I kind of want to see this. Moment of truth? No. Okay. So, all right, well, let's repair the ship and get the hell off the planet. And now I should be able to repair the pulse engine. Yep, got all the things I need. 
Sweet. Charge equipment with plutonium. And charge... Collect thormium 9. Charge up your pulse engine. Refuel the launch thrusters. Right. So I need to find some Heridium 9. I haven't got long. Better be quick. Journey milestone complete. Oh, that's zinc. Super useful, though. Starship repair. Yep, thanks. Don't need to be... Oh, I wish it didn't pull me out of, of the game to kind of show me these long achievement windows. I know what I did. I know what I did, game. I know I'm good at it. I, I, did, I, did, I did a good job. Okay, so we're, we're scanning for Heridium 9. Ah! So this thing's lighting up for me. What does that mean? Thormium 9, this is what I need. 27. Is that going to be enough? Well, let's find out. Oh, God, no. No, it's the drones. Leave me alone. So let's take a look. Starship. Pulse engine. Charge. That's it! We're fully fueled! Let's get the hell out of Dodge. Where's my ship? Ten seconds, nine. Yeah! Oh man, I'm gonna be I'm gonna be so glad to get the hell off this rock. Okay. Whoa! Okay! I'm in space! How do I go? Right, fly Starship into space. Hold R2 to accelerate. Fly up using left stick to exit atmosphere. Aha, here we go. We're going to go 90 degrees. That's straight up. Hope I don't stall. So I can see the planet down there. No, all I see is fog at the moment. There we go. Okay, let's just get into space. Too high to initiate landing. Yes, okay. Circle to boost. Hey, we're in space. We discovered this. Oh, check it out. What's this up here, though? There are some green dudes in space. Some spaceships up here. I have a gun. But I don't know how to shoot it. Okay, now I do. Okay, so it's a circle to boost. All right, let's go and check out these ships over here. But we've got to be careful because we don't want to hit into an asteroid. Looks like we're in the middle of an asteroid field here. Acquire hyperdrive technology, build hyperdrive, and fuel the hyperdrive. We need to do those things to leave the star system. All right, wow. Well, that's going to be a big undertaking. Let's just take a look back down on the planet for what I've left behind. Oh, man. It's been an emotional journey. And that way to Gifo Sutung 5. Arrive indefinitely. <laughs> Undiscovered. Wow, oh man, there's so much depth to this game. I'm not exactly sure how we're going to kind of get through uh, and build uh, the next part of the ship, though. I'm going to call it here. This has been No Man's Sky, and if you want to see me play some more, make sure you hit like and, um, and subscribe, because I definitely want to come back to this. But what I might do is, now that I've had a taste for it, and I've experienced what it has to offer, I really want to kind of round off the edges and basically refine my experience and wait for it to launch on PC. At the moment, it's on PS4, and I wanted to play it so early that I just kind of took the hit. But I definitely want to wait until the PC version is released so I can play it proper without any frame rate drops and horrible loading times. So join me next time when I'll probably skip forward past the intro and the tutorial into the space part, and uh, we'll continue our journey into No Man's Sky next episode. But until next time, guys... Take care.